obviously it's Saturday, so I had to do a bit of shopping. But I won't bore you with that. Let's just get home and I'll show you what we're up to today. Right, so I've just come in to see if I can get this drone again. Can't wait now. Tu vas acheter l'expo Oui, bien sûr. Ouais, ouais. D'accord. Euh, tac, je vais chercher la boîte, ne bougez pas. Hop, je vais prendre la boîte, s'il vous plaît. Oui, D'accord. Merci beaucoup. Non, sa boîte. Tac. Pour faire euh, la vidéo YouTube. D'accord. Ouais. C'est tout. C'est tout. tout Passez une bonne journée. Merci. Au revoir. Au revoir. Oh yeah! Ah. Finally! So, I had to buy the Expo... What word am I trying to think? I had to buy the display model. Um, they didn't have any stock. I just, I just wanted it. So I got a little bit of a reduction on that. I can't wait to get home now. Right, so before I can take the drone out for a spin, it needs to be on charge. And that's not because I've got any self-restraint, because believe me, I've got none. Because it won't physically take off until it's got a certain amount of battery, so while that's charging... <sighs> got to do some DIY stuff, haven't I? <laughs> so what I want to do while I'm waiting for the concrete pad stuff is to just try and get everything as weather tight as possible because it's getting cold now and I want to keep working. I'm going to make some doors. One for here and one for here. There's going to be nothing carpentry whiz kid about it. It's just two basic doors to shut the hole. It's getting really windy now. I don't know if you can hear properly. Hopefully you can. I've cut all the bits. Just gonna lay them out on here, glue and screw them, coat of paint and mount the door, hopefully. As easy as that. Right, you help dad then? Yeah? yeah? Right. Just gonna let this squeeze up really hard all over there. Thomas, want to squeeze? Oh, good boy. I'm turning off the highway, looking for a higher road, heading for a better life without the heavy flights. I've done my share of dealing. I lied and I cheat. One door. So before I mount all the hardware and stuff, I'm going to give it a quick dust over paint. So we're using the same paint that we've used all around like the property on the windows and stuff. It's a Brittany Blue, which is classic, classic French shuttery paint. Quick dust over, and then I can mount all the hardware. Safety first and all that. You know me always with a PPE. Right, well that's going to take a little while to dry. That drone must be charged by now. Let's go take a look. Ooh, I'm excited about this one. So, it's a lot bigger than the last one. So normally I used to catch it in midair and flip it over. I'm pretty sure that would take my fingers off. So I'm going to launch it from the ground now. Oh, can't wait. Oh. oh 
my god, that's fast. <laughs> that's something else. Now it's not the best day to test this because it's pretty windy and miserable looking but the reason this is going to impact the vlogs is because the camera is so much better and one thing that's really helpful for me is that it's got an automatic follow function. So instead of me having to control it while I'm driving the van, I can just send it up in the air, it can follow me. Oh, it's going to be full of dreamy b-rolls these next few vlogs. If I'm going to be honest, there's going to be no more door making today. I'm going to have a play with this, get to grips with it. Maybe back to work tomorrow, I don't know. Depends how fun it is. I feel like tomorrow's vlog is going to be very droney and cinematic. I'll see you tomorrow.